Hello guys, hello guys. Welcome to another episode of uh, Triple J. Hi, Miss Juicy Joints. Um, back by popular demand. I know I took a, a small hiatus uh, for about, I think it's been like two weeks now. But I was just busy. I've been studying, you know, again, bar exam. Um, and then, um, you know, my parents, well, my dad was on vacation and we were doing some stuff around the house, you know, house projects. So got a little busy, but... Um, it's Friday. I figured um, since you guys have been asking me and calling me and you know telling me, oh, when are you doing next food review? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right, I got a couple items. So today I'm gonna review the Starbucks breakfast burrito. This is a sausage, egg, and cheese burrito. Pretty standard, I think, at Starbucks. I, I, I think it's like a newer item, and I wanted to do a review on it. I've been trying it for a couple a couple times, and I I really love it. So I wanted to show you guys that. So here's a here's a video of that real quick. We'll, we'll get into that. And then also I stopped by Krispy Kreme. I wanted to do a review of the donuts, which I mean, you guys, <clears throat> I'm sure a lot of you have gotten to Krispy Kreme, but you know, have you seen me eat one in camera? Probably not. So we'll do that. And uh, you know, we'll, we'll talk about a little tips and tricks to, to deal with the Krispy Kreme donuts if you don't get them fresh. Because um, obviously fresh and not are the best but if for some reason you go and they're not fresh there's a way to kind of get around that and i'm sure you guys know that secret as well but we'll share it on this video today um <clears throat> i'll also do a review of the strawberry acai acai i think I'm, I'm i think i'm saying that right um again starbucks item pretty typical uh this is what gets mixed with the pink drink um if you guys like the coconut milk in it um i like it just like this but pink drink is delicious and I figured, you know, I got one of these I got, since I got the breakfast burrito. I'm like, yeah, screw it. Why not? So we'll do a review on that. And then the lady at um at Krispy Kreme today, I went to the drive-thru. She accidentally gave me someone else's order and she let me keep it. I think this is a pineapple blast or pineapple cooler. I'll do a review on that. I mean, I kind of cheated a little bit already and I tried it. Eh, you know, that's that's kind of your hint right now. But again, I'll do a review just just for fun. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get, go ahead and get started. So let's start with um, introducing my friend here, Scooby, who's gonna, gonna be joining me in, in some of my videos, some of my adventures. This is from uh, Build a Bear. It was a gift, and I just wanted to show you guys uh, my my dog, Scooby, with his tongue out. Oh, and he talks. I don't even know if you could hear that, but um, so he's awesome. He's <clears throat> Build a Bear just uh, added him on, you know, since the movie came out back in, I think it was in May, um, and he's got a little T-shirt, you know. Um, he's supposed to come up pajamas, but they didn't have pajamas. But um, he also smells like uh, Girl Scout cookies. I guess that's an add-on you can do at uh, Build a Bear with a lot of the uh, items there. So he smells. Like uh, those coconut Samoas that uh, everybody's obsessed with. So it's it's awesome. Um, but yeah, he, I, I love him a lot. He's very cuddly. Um, and I figured, you know, he, he could join in the food reviews as well. Um, so let me see if I can add him to the background there. Scooch over a little bit. <clears throat> All right, so first up is the breakfast burrito. Let's go ahead and give it a bite. Here's what it looks like inside. Now... Mind you, I just got a pocket of air, so I'm going to have to bite it again. Mm -mm -mm. Can't go wrong with the breakfast burrito here. If you guys like sausage, egg, cheese... And you like you like them wrapped in the, in the uh, flour tortillas, Starbucks, man, they're throwing down. Now I'm sure this is reheated, right? I think a lot of stuff is pre-made, but they do a really good job reheating it. I mean, it's crispy on the outside, but it's soft on the inside. It's cheesy, just overall deliciousness. Solid nine out of ten for breakfast item at at uh, Starbucks. And it's not like I go to Starbucks often. For me, it's more like a treat, so I go once in a while. You know, I am a rewards member and stuff. I like getting the points. So, definitely solid 9 right here. 9 out of 10. Oh, 
Oh man, this is delicious. Now, there's really no item at Starbucks that is really nasty. With a couple exceptions. I mean, again, I'm not a big coffee drinker. <clears throat> I don't think the coffee's nasty. I just don't drink coffee that much. And, um, you know, uh, w when I get coffee items, I used to when I was younger. Now that I don't drink coffee as much, I, I don't. I usually go for more like the fruity drinks, um, the teas, hot teas, cold teas. Um, and then anything that doesn't have, uh, lactose in it. So, like, any milk, milk-based products, I try to avoid. Of course, it's got cheese in it, but, eh, it's breakfast. Who cares? Obviously, the strawberry outside. Out of the Starbucks drinks. Nine and a half, man. Out of ten. Can't go wrong with this item. It's refreshing. It's not too sweet. They put, you know, dried strawberries in it, and they get wet, and then they go up through the straw, and it's really delicious. Um, some people don't eat the strawberries, but I do. I, I think that's one of the best features of the drink, is the fact that they put, like, fresh fruit in it. You know, it's freeze-dried. Um, but the drink overall, I mean, you, you can look at it. It's not, like, super dark, it, you know, it, and that's what I like about it, you know, because compared to this piece of trash, which we're going to talk about, um... Yeah, it, it, this is not a refresher. This is not... I don't know what the hell this is. Uh, but let's go ahead and do it. And of course... They forgot to give me a straw, so... I gotta use my Starbucks straw. And mind you, I don't think I'm gonna drink this. Because this is trash. But for you guys. Ah! Oh my god. Okay. What does this taste like? I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like some kind of tropical fruit. You guys ever... Oh, man. Take a cup of water and a bag of sugar and just pour the sugar in it? Yeah, me neither. But that's what it tastes like. It tastes like someone just put yellow dye in some... And, oh, and yellow yellow dye in a cup of water and just poured a bag of sugar without any regard to how much to add into it. And then, you know, blended it with ice, chopped the ice down, and they called it a frozen drink. This thing is already melted. Like, look at this. It's already, like, sloshing around. Ah! The worst review number I'm going to give right now, that's, that's not even worthy of half a point. That's half a point out of ten, you guys. That is disgusting. I, I'm sure there are, you know, I don't think, I would not even give that to my kids. If I had kids, I would not give that. That's just a bag of sugar with water in it. I'm sorry. Krispy Kreme, what are you doing? Like, stick to donuts. You don't need to be getting into the culotta game or the drink game. Stick to coffee and donuts. You guys do great with that. Don't do any of that drinky stuff. Because um, I know they have like the espressos now and they blend them like frappuccino style. Like no, 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 no. Just, just stop. Just stick to the donuts and coffee. You know, maybe uh, add in some um, oat milk or milk alternatives and um, call it a day. You're good with that disgusting that was yeah that was bad that was really bad ah just my tongue is just ugh. um and then finally long you know crispy cream donut which again i'm sure many of you have gone if you haven't gotten a crispy cream i highly 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 recommend you go it really sealed this box up. there we go let me see i'm gonna try to get this on camera without them falling um yeah, the, the, light was, the light was on, so these are pretty fresh. Um, if for some reason you don't get these fresh, what you can do, and, I, and I'm surprised I don't do this more often, is stick one in the microwave for like less than 10 seconds, which I'm going to do right now um, before letting you guys go. Stick it to a plate. And just, you know, the best, best way to eat a Krispy Kreme donut, original glaze, is hot. But um, sometimes the machine, the they don't have the donuts being made, and um, you know the best thing to do is this. So, ten seconds in the microwave. I'll flip it and see it. Oh, my fingers in the way. And uh, yeah, we'll give it. A, we'll give it a try. All right, that's ten seconds from thirty. Hopefully, it's not super hot. It should. Oh, meant to do this. Shouldn't look too hot. Oh, nice and soft. Here we go. Oh, wow. 
Oh man, sorry. I need to get used to my camera being on the on the other side. Mm. Soft and gooey. 10 out of 10 for donuts. Mm. If you guys didn't know, I, there's a secret rumor going around um, that Krispy Kreme donuts are made out of uh, mashed potatoes. That's like one of their secret ingredients. That's why they're so fluffy and good. I believe it. I mean, I already, I already finished it. Oh. And they're all sticky. Anyway, those are the quick reviews. Um, so thanks for supporting you guys. And um, we'll see you guys next time.